Wednesday morning, Coach Petrino and his counterpart from Kansas State, Bill Snyder, met face-to-face -face for the first time this week. Both coaches addressed the media for the final time here in Dallas at a joint press conference. Certainly, I'd love to see our seniors go out with a win. They've done a lot for this football program. They've set the standards for how we're going to work and how we're going to operate, um, not only on the field, but off the field and, and in the weight room. So we really want to send the seniors out with a win. That, that's probably the most important thing for me. Watching uh, the tape of the A&M and Arkansas ball game uh, really uh, gave me a, a, a true and dramatic and uh, startling understanding of what uh, Arkansas football is, is really all about. I thought it was a great, great comeback. The, the Cotton Bowl staff has been tremendous and it's been a great experience, something that all our players and all the families will remember as we go on. Now we need to get ready for the game and, and we know that's going to be fun. All the, all the fans will start coming in today, start filling up the hotel and, and uh, we'll move tomorrow to a, to a different hotel. Following the press conference, the Razorbacks practiced at Cowboys Stadium for about an hour and a half, their final full practice here in the Metroplex. And with that, Bobby Petrino live is on the air from Dallas, Texas. How about them hogs of the Cotton Bowl? And an enthusiastic crowd, as you can tell, on hand for Bobby Petrino Live, the Bowl Edition, here at the Team Hotel in Dallas. It's been a great experience for our players and our families, and the Cotton Bowl staff has done an excellent job of, of providing hospitality. We've had great events for our players. The facilities for our meetings and for our practices are, are top-notch. So it's been a great experience so far. We just need to top it off Friday night. There you go. While the radio show was taking place here at the Hilton Anatole, the team was over at American Airlines Center as they were watching the Dallas Mavericks host the Phoenix Suns in an NBA contest. Razorbacks, as you heard Coach Petrino mention earlier, will change team hotels tomorrow. Fans starting to trickle in. We're seeing more and more each day, but especially today. Fan activities kind of crank up tomorrow. We'll cover some of those for you as well as the big play lunch and a final chance for the team before they lock it down for Friday night's ball game. With the Razorbacks at the 2012 Cotton Bowl on Blair Cartwright for ArkansasRazorbacks.com.